So, do you want to see how violence comes from video games or movies or any type of media that we see from the social network? Um, let's take a peek on this. Uh, hey, look! Uh, I just got a Pokemon game called Pokemon Moon, or I mean Ultra Moon, and it has tons of fighting. I mean, can't you see? It has tons of artwork and fighting in detail. It's a it's a game about Pokemon killing each other. Oh wait, no, they say faint because you can't kill Pokemon in the game. Yes, there's kill. I mean, there's stuff in Pokemon, but. There's no death shown on the game itself, so you're teaching kids about helping others and, of course, becoming better in the game. But it's not teaching kids a killing, and there's no point. Because when I was a kid, I used to play this game, and of course, it didn't teach me about killing. Because that's the mental way of thinking about how the person overcome. And became that person that he is right now to become a killer. But gaming, of course, there's types of gaming it's like Call of Duty and all that stuff. But doesn't pr provoke them to become a killer or any type of way of become a shooter. Because there's no way that games like this can happen. And of course, I think this is kind of a dumb idea that the government are thinking about it because there's no way of them thinking that children coming from these ideas from games or movies or any type of ways yes look movies like the avengers has shooting in it and of course we still watch that but you can't blame on them because they made the movie itself and made tons of millions and of course to overgrow their company uh from marvel studios they didn't prevent or made them to make people these days to hey uh look iron man's shooting a person no they didn't make that way to make people think about it whether they could kill people but otherwise i think this is a dumb joke and of course we do care why we hate gun laws these days and 21 and over holding a gun is still kind of a bad choice to think of. I still think it's it's a bad thing. Yes, it, it may help a little, but there's still people that could still literally grab a gun at that age and still cause damage onto control. But I think it's better time to think of stopping the laws of right now, whether to end all guns for public use i mean that's the only way yes the second amendment is there but just cross it off at least just say that we don't need a second amendment anymore cross it off and it's the only way that we could ever stop it from happening and preventing people from dying of course there's other ways of dying there's weapons like swords and knives like you could always prevent that from happening of course but of course, right now we just only have one choice, and that's guns itself. And and I hope the government itself, like the main man, the president who blames uh, gaming and movies and other type of social stuff that's been going on throughout the social media. And of course, that way none of this can happen, like what happened back then in Parkland High School. So next time, I know this, I haven't uh, took video since, like, I guess a month ago, but I have been doing pretty small stuff. Um, Actually, not a lot of stuff, but I was away from YouTube, so I didn't feel like making videos because I thought this could be, I mean, the last video could be the last one that I ever shared it down, but of course... I found like making a video about, uh, I mean about this topic about gun and games and what's it going on and my opinion in the end, I think it's a dumb idea and until then, this is Christian Flores and see you next time on the next video and maybe in the future I may make 
I mean, I maybe make a video. Of course, I have uh, ways of thinking, and of course, why I talk like this is part of my speech disorder. But either way, have a nice day, and the best of luck for all of y'all.